Hey, what's up, everybody? Out here at Al's Pick and Pull. Just got a, a 91 Caprice in a couple weeks ago. Just came down here to take a look at it, see if they got anything we can use. See if I find any gold here. So it's supposed to be in row 63. Three, I think I see it right there. Okay, grill looks pretty good. No honeycombs. Blue interior. Oh man. Oh, this dash. Oh, this bottom dash piece seems to be in perfect shape. Top is gone, but this bottom right here, except for this little dumbass screw. Oh yeah, I'm definitely gonna come back and pull this oh, these door bezels look pretty good too There's only three of them. Driver's side door panel. It's not bad, it's, can, can be an easy fix. Damn, I wish I had that other bezel. Take a look around. Sometimes, sometimes things get thrown around. Oh, those tail lights are in good shape too. I don't know. Yeah, man. You're looking for disc brakes, huh? <laughs> yeah, they are. You got to find a 9C1 for those. You got to find a who? A 9C1? That's the police one. Yeah. Yeah. All right, man. Yes, sir. Damn, off. Three of those are in good shape, but I can't find the fourth one. Well, I'm for sure gonna come get this lower dash. Might even get those tail lights. Yeah. Let me go get my tools so I can get this all pulled off. So I was walking back to the car to get my tools and I noticed that they, they had another one up here. And the dash on this one ain't bad either. It's got a few cracks, but not, it ain't too bad. That bottom dash looks pretty damn good. So I'm gonna take a look at both of them. I'm gonna for sure pull one of them. This one, the door panels are all trashed. lights aren't bad oh yeah definitely getting me a bottom dash today what 
Well, y'all, as is typically the case, got every fucking size I need, except for the one I need. So it looks like it's gonna be a seven. Get them screws out. Got everything but a seven. But hopefully, hopefully I can get it done with this. Man, fuck it. Gonna give it a shot at least. So it took me a while, but I was able to get two screws off. And I was like, man, fuck that. This shit's taking too long. So I looked in the toolbox again. Bam, found a seven. Let's All get it. The screws are off. That one in the glove box is one a lot of people forget about. So you've got that one. Got the ones that go up here, which is kind of hard to see right now with the way the sun's hitting. And there's one right here under the brake release. And then those two down there. So now just need to carefully pry this off and pray it all goes good. Damn, I can already hear some shit breaking. Ooh, I did not know that. So this piece right here comes off, snaps off through the glove box. There's another fucking screw right there. Almost. Shit, no wonder it wasn't coming off. Let me take care of that. So I gotta find a way to get this in fucking one so that I can uh, get this dash off. All right, so I can't get the dash out without getting that column shifter to go down. I can't get it to go down, it's locked up. So I'm gonna remove this plate and try to get down there and move the actual steering column down some so I can safely get this dash out and get the fuck out of here. It's been a battle, y'all. Had to undo two bolts right there. Got the steering column down. Got the fucking dash out finally. Shout out to my boy Jeezy. I had to, had to use one of my lifelines, give him a call. He had to let me know what to do. But yep, so we got the dash out. Looks to be in good shape. Just needs a little bit of cleaner. We're good to go. So y'all know I couldn't wait to get home and get this cleaned up. Man, it looks good. Look at that. So here's what I ended up picking up today. Got a few A pillars, the lower dash, of course. I still haven't cleaned everything else up. I just couldn't wait to see the lower dash. And that was my total today. So overall, good day at Al's Pick and Pool. See y'all next time. Y'all stay safe out there.